This video is going to explain the BUDSUM report. The BUDSUM is the Budget Summary Report. So for my example here, the Drama Club, my BUDSUM is going to show me a list of all the budget accounts that are within the Drama Club Fund. So I'm going to click on this link and it's going to display my BUDSUM report in PDF format. On the BUDSUM, the first thing that I'm going to see is how it was sorted. So it's sorted by Fund Special Cost Center, so my Drama Club Fund, and then within there, the appropriation level, and then within there, then it's going to list each budget account. So the first column I'm going to see then is the fiscal year to date appropriated. So here on this particular budget account, here's my account code and my description of that account code, $1,000 has been appropriated. So this includes the initial budgeted figure plus or minus any adjustments that have been made to this figure so far this fiscal year. The prior fiscal year carryover encumbrances are purchase order amounts that were still outstanding at the end of the prior year and have been carried over to the current fiscal year. So for this particular budget account, there weren't any prior carryover encumbrances. The fiscal year to date expendable figure is a calculated figure made up the fiscal year to date appropriated plus prior carryover encumbrances. So this amount here is the amount budgeted for this account for the current fiscal year. What actually has been spent so far this year is recorded under the fiscal year to date actual expenditures. What has been spent so far this month is recorded under the month to date expenditures. And here current and future encumbrances as well as requ requisition amounts may be included on this report. So it just depends on what your fiscal office has chosen to include on your report. In exa our example here, they included just current and future encumbered amounts. So the fiscal year to date remaining field is a calculated field and it comes from taking the fiscal year to date expendable, this $1,000, minus what was actually expended, minus any outstanding encumbrances to give you your true remaining balance. So here we had budgeted $1,000 for the year. So far we have spent $400 of that. We don't have any outstanding encumbrances at this point. So my fiscal to date remaining balance, what I still have left to spend for this account is $600. The fiscal year to date percent expenditure slash encumbrances, this displays the percentage expended or encumbered for this budget account for the fiscal year so far. So in this case, 40% of my budgeted amount has been expended so far. And then from here, because I've sorted this by Fund Special Cost Center and then the appropriation level, it's going to go down and include all of the budget accounts within this appropriation account. And then it's going to give me a grand total of that appropriation. So here's my appropriation figure. So these are purchase services for the Drama Club Fund. And here are the total amounts. And then it goes through and starts listing the next appropriation level and the budget accounts within there and all the activity against those accounts. So at the end then, if I scroll down to the bottom of this report, it will give me grand totals then. If you would rather see the transactions that actually make up the amounts on the bud sum, if you want to see the PO and check information, Instead of a bud sum then, you would need to refer to a bud lead report.